Fabel, Fabel, Fabel. Ooh, did they did they hit that car? They hit that car. Oh, oh man. What's going on YouTube? We got some shoplifters in this video right here. Here's the crazy one. I accidentally clicked play and literally five seconds in, y'all about to see what I'm talking about. Craziest video I've ever seen in my life. Anyways, make sure that like button. Let's get into it. Make sure I subscribe as well. I almost forgot that, but yeah. I don't know how I almost forgot that. But yeah, well, check this out, man. Look at this. Hey man, keep all reverse! You gonna get bit? Since the pandemic, retail theft and related crimes have been on the rise across the nation. Some cities have taken a passive approach, allowing retail crimes into... And I'm going to tell you this real quick before we get started. I'm also a little bit under the weather. So if you somehow randomly hear me breathing every now and then, and I sound like a Waller's just dying because he's been running from a um, polar bear, my bad. So yeah, let's get into this. I'm going to try to keep the mic away, though. It gets to operate freely. Other cities have taken a more proactive approach, like Wauwatosa, Wisconsin. Hands up! Hands up! Get your hands up! He's trying to take off, trying to take off. Hey man, keep all traffic on standby. As officers get the driver out, another occupant in the vehicle has their own plans. She about to hop in the driver's seat and take flight. Put it, yeah, put it right there. The passenger ultimately surrenders, and it's just our first example to show how law enforcement are adapting to increasingly sophisticated and brazen shoplifting incidents that fund larger criminal organizations. The woman in the passenger seat was arrested, but it is unclear at this time if she was charged with anything. Dang. However, the driver was charged with operating the vehicle without consent, resisting a police officer, and possession of methamphetamine. The suspect in this next video was wanted for questioning in relation to a retail theft at the Mayfield Mall. An officer pursued the suspect, but like the last video, shoplifters have become increasingly brazen and desperate as they work to meet goals set by their crime bosses. It should be noted this incident happened only two days after the first and would be just as unpredictable. Hey, Fern, you're pulling in pursuit right now. Going eastbound Capitol. Hold on, take Pappy. Hold for your six-pack plate is out of the unit, out of 4645, negative current, 2022 at a Camry Grace, Holler, Lisboa, Derry. The man ahead of her is simply trying to fix his tire, but this suspect risks putting him right in the line of fire if things go south. That's crazy. Bro, you know how mad I would be, bro, if, if I broke... Bro, you know how mad I'd be. You already got to deal with your broken tire. I mean, not even if broken tire. Your flat tire on the side of the road. Now you got this dumb son of a... Mm, pulling right behind you in, 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 in harm's way when they're about to point guns. I, bro, if that was me, like, so like if I, my, my truck broke down the side of the road and she pulled and tried this stuff, I'd, I'd roll up to the window my damn self. I'd be like, I'm over here trying to deal with my flat tire, you stupid son of a bitch. Then <laughs> you over here causing all this drama and stuff, man. Like, come on, bro. Come on now. I don't know if they're going to keep going. They're behind a disabled vehicle. 146. I'll wait for another vehicle to come in case I exit and they take off again. Again, we're eastbound Capitol, about the 11000 block. Like, what are you doing? 10 4. 
Ten four. If one just wants to set up sticks ahead of us, just in case. Officers arrived on scene and strategized on the best approach to the situation. Do you want me to approach and then if they take off, you can go? Sure. That works. How many, do you know how many occupants or anything? Maybe two. Huh? Maybe two. Hard to tell at the tank. Okay. Is he set up yet? Uh, I didn't hear him say he was set up yet. Okay. Driver of the Camry, roll all your windows down now. Driver of the Camry, roll your windows down now. He needs to have his gun out, dude. I ain't gonna lie to you. He needs to have his gun out. 146. 606 is trying to make contact. We're not getting compliance with the driver to roll the windows down. Foot still on the brake. The second officer attempted to reason with the driver for another full minute. That's when the situation escalated. I just saw the front wheels move. You wanna grab my sticks and try and slide them under the car? Yeah. On driver's side, in case they try and take off. A third officer approached the vehicle with stop sticks, designed to punk. That's what's gonna make them move. Well, it's too late for them though. Puncture the tires if the suspect attempted to flee. 146, we got sticks in front of the vehicle right now. I was about to say, now you need to pull up closer. I was saying, why didn't, why didn't this, bro, why didn't he get right behind them? Looks like the sticks hit. We are eastbound on Capitol. Speeds are 60. Traffic is medium. They are weaving in and out of traffic. They, they hit that car? They hit that car? Oh. Oh, man. And Pieces of shit. Bell, 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 bell. Three occupants. Her big ass can't even run. <laughs> Left the car rolling, bro. Passenger took off going westbound, and the driver took off going eastbound. Officers began using scent dogs to find some trace of where the driver might have ran. Yeah, I think so. That's what kind of loading you know what was going on. Switch so many channels. 
travel from this district. Get your hands up, I see you behind the garbage can. Oh, face away from me, face, face away. How much y'all wanna bet she's gonna like the victim and like she did nothing wrong and they're doing her dirty. How much you wanna bet? Show me your hands, show me your hands. All right, I, oh, I, 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 got, I got cover. On the knees, let's get her. Get, get, her. get on your knees, drop down to your knees. Keep her hands in your back. Yeah. Contact on body camera. Sure. Sure. What's your name? What's your name? What's your name? Okay. I just want to make sure. I see that the top was ripped. Was that? For, did you get bit by the dog at all? Anywhere? No. Okay. I just want some. Okay. We'll we'll take care of that in just a second. All right. I'm just confirming that you have you yeah, you didn't get bit. My that was already there. Is okay. All right. Stand up for us. All right. You want to continue? Uh, we only had one going this way, so I think this is. Yep. Check here for another evidence. So, so what? What caught me was, you know, I, I saw what you saw. Like, oh, he definitely is interested. Yeah, he pulled He's hard definitely interested. And, and then I came around. I'm like, okay, there's nothing there, and, and I didn't see. I couldn't tell it's a I person here, either. but then when I got to here, I could see what looked like, to be. Because he uh, barked, and I'm yeah. like, "Oh, she's barking at something." Yep. I thought maybe, yeah, my bad. Yep. But so she was, like I said, for she the was, nature of the She was fence. passive, on her, uh, basically back against here, and knees out in front, sitting there. Yeah. Sorry. We have been able to confirm that he is indeed a good boy. I, know, I, I, I was like, <laughs> like oh, "Is something there?" You know. Yep. Oh man, that a good boy. Yeah. yeah. As for the suspect. Dariana Anderson was arrested, and when her vehicle was searched, officers found men's clothing with tags still attached. Her she's smiling in the mug shop, like she just did something good. Her bond was set at $1,500. All individuals in this video are presumed innocent. <laughs> I like, Whoa. What I told you, she was going to act like she's innocent. <laughs> yeah, in the corner. Yeah. It was a garbage, there's a garbage can there, and it's stuck behind that. Yeah. So.